What's up YouTube? It's your boy Carvencer Reg and welcome back to another video. And today, you see I got the G37 right here. I know y'all seen the title on the thumbnail, but let's just go ahead and get into it. We are finally doing Chrome Delete and I'm adding hints of carbon to the G37. I'll show you guys in a minute, but all this will be black, finally. All this will be black so we can get that true black on black look. Now, before I said I really don't know how I really feel about the Chrome Delete, I kind of wanted to keep that luxury feel. But now I'm like, nah, this got to be it, bro. This car is going to look so, so, so different. I'm going to see if I get these restored too because this will look way better with the presentation. These lights always getting like that. So I'm going to see if I get that cleared or whatever. But this grill is going to be gone. I can't wait. Now, I don't know if I want to debash this Infinity right here and just keep this in the G37X. I don't know. Uh, we'll see later down the line in the future. But um, I'm so excited. I'm about to be on my way right now. But yes, y'all, we're finally getting Chrome Delete. This is like probably been, besides coilovers and springs, Chrome Delete has like been like the highly requested mod that I should do to this car. My bad, y'all. Um, I know I was supposed to record the whole installation process and stuff like that, but got to talking, running my mouth, forgot to record. So right now I'm gonna just show you guys the finished product. So as you guys can see, first things first, we added that carbon fiber mesh grill. Now, when I had bought these intakes, this was definitely on my list to buy. I wanted to get this grill so bad because number one, I want you to see the intakes, man. I want you to see that. It looks so aggressive in the front. I'm not gonna lie. It looks real aggressive in the front. I love that. It just really just needs a car wash, to be honest. It needs a car wash, but I love the look of this carbon fiber mesh grill. I'm gonna go ahead and give you all a close up on it so y'all can see. It looks real nice. I already got a dead bug on it and stuff. Oh my God. And then as you guys can see, I went ahead and restored the headlights. So the headlights are clean. I wanted to test them out because, so this is the things that I'm thinking about doing. And I want to hear you guys in the comments on what you guys got to say. So the first thing was, I was going to keep them clear like this. That's why I want to get the headlights clean, just to see how the way I like it. And if I like it, then I'm gonna have to try to get them clean permanently because I love when these headlights are clean. Like I do love these lights. I'm not gonna lie. I have bought the GTR style lights, but they came back messed up and I just got my money back and I didn't buy them again. But that's the second thing. Should I buy the GTR style headlights since I got this grill? I'm kind of thinking I should now to kind of make it look more aggressive, but these lights do kind of look aggressive. Now, the third thing, I keep these lights and I just tint them just a little bit, just tint them a little bit. I feel like it would give it that aggression, more aggression in the front. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments right now of what I should do. Should I just, you know, keep the headlights like this? Should I get the GTR style lights? Or should I just go ahead and tint these? Let me know in the comments below. Now about these little chrome pieces right here. I know I'm missing one right here. And I've been saying for the longest I need to get one. I'm definitely going to get one pretty soon. But um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just go ahead and take these off and spray paint them black so we can kind of like eliminate a little bit more chrome of this car. Still got chrome on here, but we did most of it. You know what I'm saying? We did. We did most of it today. But let me know how you guys liking the car, man. Is it looking fire? I think it looks nice. I think it's giving me a whole aggressive vibe, like it's something different, something new. I'm not used to seeing my car like this. This is crazy. Like. I'm loving it, I'm loving it, I'm loving it. So as you guys can see, I did Chrome Delete, but before we get into that, let's talk about these mirror caps. Now I bought some mirror caps for these mirrors. Now the mirror caps they sold me was booth. So um, it was like halfway, it was going like to right here. So I'm like, bro, what the hell? That's supposed to cover the whole mirror. But you know, they sold me some booth mirror caps. But anyways, on a good note, <laughs> I did Chrome Delete. As you guys can see, it looks so much better too. So I see what you guys were saying. Like it just matches, it just flows with the car very good with the with the rims and now the car is black. It's just giving me that black on black, that true black on black look. I did like the chrome because with the chrome, it gave it a more luxury feel. This is giving me a more sport feel now. Like this car went from luxury to like a sport car <laughs> that quick. So it's giving me that sport look. 
um eventually i do want to get the big brake package that's why i didn't do caliber paint but originally if you guys watched that video when i went to go get an estimate for chrome delete i was gonna get the calibers painted but i didn't get them painted the reason why is because i do want to upgrade to the big brake package so i feel like that would just be a waste of money so um i didn't do that but anyways let's go ahead into the back let's go to the back of the car y'all see that i added this carbon fiber wing man How's it looking, man? How's it looking? Let me know. How's it looking? Is it looking fire? This car is looking fire. I know I need a car wash. I'm getting one tomorrow. I'm going to give me a hand wax, too. So it's going to be able to bring out this paint a lot more. But, man, I feel like this car is looking fire now. Like, oh, my gosh. This is looking nice. I'm not going to lie. I'm loving it. I'm loving my car so much. I really do. I love this car. But, uh now this is another thing i want to i want you guys to comment below and let me know what i should do now this is the only chrome i don't mind keeping uh, a lot of people like to debatch this the infinity stuff or whatever but i really don't want to debadge it the only thing that i would debadge is this and i would keep this in the g37x now what i could do is he said i could wrap these but the only thing is that it, it can't wrap inside he can only wrap on the outside but i could buy all black ones and then he could just wrap over it or whatever that's what he said or i could take them all off i really don't want to take them all off though or i could just keep it how the way it is and just take this off so but i'm really ain't i'm i'm really just thinking about just taking this off and just keeping this that would be like my only chrome on a car uh because i do i do like the infinity sign i do want people to know this is a g37x so all-wheel drive infinity and then um i do want to add the 3.7 dude i like that little badge but y'all can see it's the other part of the chrome delete looking real nice right man it's looking nice man hold on let me let me do a side shot like this yeah this is looking fire shout out to my boy b man he told me i had to tilt that roof man if you're watching this man i tilt the roof just for you bro <laughs> gotta tilt that roof but i'm liking how the way this car is coming along so far the next mod what i should be doing with this car is since the carbon fiber mirror caps was boof i'm gonna go ahead and wrap these mirrors in carbon fiber so i'm gonna do that in two weeks so it won't be the next video but it'll be a couple of videos after that i'm liking it man i love this car man it's, it's looking so good um i own this car well it's going on three years now and it's just every year every year i'm adding something to it and i appreciate y'all for telling me to do that chrome delete it definitely brings out a whole nother look onto your car if you don't have chrome delete I definitely say you should do it because it's going to give it more sporty feel even though that chrome it makes it look luxury but it just gives this car more sportier feel especially if you have black you know you got that real true black on black theme going on but um i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys enjoy um i hope you guys are enjoying my g37 content out there hope you guys are enjoying my g35 content i hope you guys are watching my g35 content because we're building that car and also the legend <laughs> but anyways i hope you guys are enjoying my content overall let me know what videos you guys would like to see with the g35 or the g37 or the acro legend i definitely want to make that happen for you guys and i don't say this enough i really do appreciate you guys without y'all you know this channel wouldn't be where is that today and i do appreciate you guys for tuning in showing your support by liking and commenting um especially the people who's always doing it you know your support never goes unnoticed i really 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 do appreciate you guys um and thank you guys for rocking with me you know we going on two years of me being on youtube and you know it's been a great experience for me and i wouldn't give it up for the world even though sometimes i do get frustrated i'd be like man i don't know if i could do this you know, I'd be down on myself, but then I snap back out of it real quick and be like, man, I got people who tune in and watch me every week when I drop on Friday. And, you know, I do uploads on Sundays a little bit. So, um, you know, I really do appreciate you guys. Thank you for rocking with me. I love y'all for real, for real, man, because I'm telling y'all, man, we, we, you know, we gonna go up. And I'm not gonna lie, like, if I wasn't on YouTube, I wouldn't did half of the stuff I did with this car, like, 
the only thing I did when I wasn't on uh, YouTube was I had got a muffler delete and I had got the um, some subs and, and, and some window tint. I would have probably kept those rims and just powder coated them black, but I would have never did all of this. So I really do appreciate you guys because you guys make me kind of jump out of my own little element and making me like build this car. And I don't know, it's just something different, man. Every time I look at it, man, I just appreciate it more and more and more and more. Um, I don't know, I'm kind of just rambling right now, but I just wanted to say that before I end this video. It's like, I really do appreciate y'all, man. Y'all family, for real. Like, everybody know, like, you know, people be in my DMs all the time asking me questions, or even in the comments asking me questions, I answer them back, all the comments. Unless you want some hate, then I ain't gonna lie, I don't reply at all because I just don't give you my energy. Come at me positive, I'm definitely gonna give you that positive energy. When you come at me with any questions, I'm definitely gonna answer them the best way I can. I don't know everything, you know, I try, I don't act like, I don't try to act like I do know everything, you know, I try to come on here and, and just be myself, you know what I'm saying, so that's all I really be trying to do, but I really do appreciate you guys, definitely stay tuned to my channel, y'all, I got a lot of content coming, like what I said before earlier, I really do appreciate you guys for rocking with me, thank you guys so much, it means a lot to me, but this video is over, I'll catch y'all in the next video, peace. Stop playing with me, stop playing, stop playing with me, stop playing with me.